Well, that was kind of funny. I was about two birds in a stone's throw pitch away of being done. And I told you how hot it was. The phone overheated. It said, sorry, device overheating, shutting off. So we're going to have to have this in two parts. So, all right, there's that. I'll go ahead and put that on. Oh, you guys think I'm this good. <laughs> you ever try putting a filter with a magnet on? one hand and then holding a phone in the other yeah let's talk about that the word is awesome same thing hand tight this one I'm just gonna go to it bottoms and we're done that's it she's good we're not gonna worry about it got the oil plan plugged back in and it's torqued to about I don't know 20 foot-pounds of torque and of course the uh, oil filter is up there and I've got uh, one full spin on it after it's bottomed out. We are done under here. Now let's go up top and put some fluids in this bad boy and fire her up. There it is. The good stuff. I always say that. The good stuff. But this is this. This is the good stuff. You know, until next year when they come up with something better. Then this won't be the good stuff. This will be the okay stuff. And then this will just be mediocre stuff because it'll be something ten times better. I know you love watching it go in. Oh, this is like gonna be a chore here. All right, you get the idea. I'm gonna put ten quarts in. All right, there's one gallon in. Gallon number two. You know it's uh. Pretty aggravating that the stupid phone overheated and shut off because I mean this is gonna be like a two-minute video of me putting oil in a truck and then somebody's gonna find this without reading it saying part two. And they're gonna be like, oh what the heck, he's just putting oil in a truck. No, no, there's a 13-minute video before this video that shows how to do all this. Look at the sun's coming out beating on the phone again. It's gonna overheat again. This is insane. Hot, hot day, hot day. All right, got 10 quarts in. Put the oil fill cap back on. Put the dipstick back in. I did that half a quart of transmission fluid. There was no way I could hold that funnel, hold the phone and put that half quart in. All right, so everything's in, everything's all torqued down, everything's looking good, let's go ahead and fire the truck up. Now, what I've never done, so I've never looked at the dashboard on this one when I started it. So uh, let's see what happens there. Oh, I got 12,000 miles on the truck. I said 11,000. Reset oil. Are you sure you want to reset? Yes. Oh. Duh. Gotta go to the yes side. There we go. 100% on oil. Alright, everything looks good. Sweet. Oh. Look at that. It's getting 14.4. You know why? Because the freaking truck went into regen mode. I was getting 22, 23, 24 on the interstate coming back hauling about 85 miles an hour and then it went into regen mode and just sat there at nine miles to the gallon oh my god i'm so ripping this stuff off the truck it's going bye bye all right guys that's a reset on the oil that's an oil change and transmission fluid filter on the uh, 2017 dodge dodge <laughs> jeez 2017 uh Chevy 2500. I've owned too many trucks. I've done too many videos, it all just blends in. Alright, thanks for watching, guys. Give us a thumbs up. Isn't that pretty? That's pretty right there. Not the color, the word. See ya!